Man, I've missed this guy. I'm talking about this man right here, trending with Trent. He went and had a amazing, Ooh. amazing vacay. Mardi Gras celebration too. Yes. There we go. There was a little pup over your shoulder. We'll get to Yay. him in a minute. If you're celebrating Mardi Gras, please tweet tag us at ATL and Co. Of course, today is the day. So if you're having celebratory sips, lovely eats, getting out that king cake. Oh shoot, and Caroline Travis. put in a special request for oh, a king cake. Yum. I yep. gotta, I gotta go find one. You must. She loves it, I know. On our ANC Facebook page, we have live coverage of the parade with our sister station, WWL. Here's Chef Kevin. He's showing you some live footage right now. Of course, the bands are coming through. And we just love the you know, spirit I've never been. of NOLA. Have you? Not, I, I, well, of course, I've been to New Orleans quite a few times, but always like spring break, summer, but not right. the not, day of. I know. That would That's be incredible. incredible. That's got to be a bucket list thing. Yes. It, definitely. We have two little poodles who are celebrating. They're based in NOLA. They're called Poodle Brothers for Life. Thank you to producer Sydney for sharing her besties. Poodles. Look at them. They're okay, decked out. That is so precious. Reuben and Levi. Yeah, they're like, let's celebrate. <laughs> Indeed. Aww. And I did celebrate over the weekend. I went to Riviera Maya, our grooms, Andres and Asher. Congratulations. An incredible wedding event that I got to officiate, CP. You, you guys, let's I take was a look so proud at the, of him. Are my beautiful classics, I call them, um, because you know, I've known these people since I was six years old. I can't. Incarnate Word Academy. Six. And so Andres is just a great friend from tennis team for many years. And and here we are celebrating, honey. It really worked out with the officiating because Christine gave me a little pep talk on the plane. She was like, you got this. You kind of do for it for a living. I mean, yeah, right. I was like, Trent, don't get in your head about it. Yeah. You're going to be perfect. But I was saying prayers because I know nerves can get. It's this is not like it's an easy job to be on camera. But so when you're like talking in front of an intimate group of friends, I find, yeah, it's definitely yeah. even more nerve wracking. And at Destination Wedding, they had only 150 people. There. Oh, my Hello. gosh. Proud of Congrats you. Congrats to you, too. Twin Tuesday. This mother is her name is Brittany. She's an elementary school teacher and she had one set of twins another Levi and Luca followed by another one no, 13 no. months later what what boys and now girls <gasps> you're good to go girl what I think so Kathy shared amazing she's so lucky but we also heard from Suzanne she said that's why I didn't have a second until seven years after my twins yeah Please, God bless her, and somebody please <laughs> offer to help. My God, good for her. Oh, remember when I got to meet those? Christine Beautiful met ladies. them in the, the what, what, you were the south of France? I, in at, Provence? Uh, at Le Where Bristol Hotel. Pally? Jim was like, late night, I want to buy everybody here a, a, a glass of wine. Nobody was in there except for those two twins. Mary, Kate, and Ashley And Jim Olsen. didn't even know who they were. I was like, oh my God, oh my God. And we talked to them for about an hour and a half. An hour and oh my god, that is yes. literally a dream of mine. It takes two. <laughs> it was many years ago. Let's take a look at the late great Christy Alley and the twins. Now a couple of identical strangers have decided to play matchmaker. All they gotta do is meet once, then they'll fall in love for sure. Wow! Now you should look like a real jerk on a horse. You really should put some iodine on your butt. Cut. Wait a minute, and Steve Gutenberg. Yes. Oh my God! An adventure of a lifetime. I love that. Okay, of course, our, oh. our prayers, our thoughts are with the Carter family as he's seeking hospice treatment in Plains, Georgia. The Atlantic, Atlanta City Council issued a special proclamation to honor his great contributions to not only our state, our country, but the world. Yes, thank you so much, Trent. And yes, we'll keep him in our prayers. And guys, thank you so much for tuning in on this terrific Tuesday. We appreciate you always. Keep the conversation going on all of our Facebook pages. In the meantime, have a terrific day. I'll see you tomorrow.